There are three kinds of forces which apply in fluids in three dynamics. Pressure, shear, and gravity. And chapter one deals with the first kind, pressure. Now, there are two questions I'd like you to think about as you prepare for chapter one. The first kind is, first question is a mathematical kind, and the second one is some understanding of the physics. The first question is, in short, in which direction is pressure pushing? Now imagine that I gave you a USB stick, and on my USB stick there was data, there was information for the value of pressure at every point in space at a given time point. If you had all this data in front of you, how would you compute, how would you calculate using the computer or by hand, how would you compute the direction in which pressure is pushing at any given point in space? And this is the first question. So, how do we express, how do we quantify the net effect of pressure at any given point in space? In which direction is it pushing? That's the first question that we're asking ourselves. The second question is understanding what pressure does in a static fluid. And the question is as follows. What is buoyancy? Now, in some cases, in some particular conditions, pressure acts on bodies and causes them to float. And this can be floating in water, floating in different liquids, floating in air even, yeah, like a hot air balloon. And this flotation force we call buoyancy. And the question is, what is buoyancy? What, how does it work? And how, how can we explain it? Um, and so to be more precise and perhaps um, narrow down the question to something you can answer, um, think about this. What is it about a hot air balloon that makes it float? What is it about the hot air inside the hot air balloon that helps it float? And so these are the two questions I'd like you to think about as you scramble through um, the script notes as you prepare for chapter one. One is in which direction is pressure pushing and how do I express this mathematically? And two is what is flotation force? What is buoyancy? And how, how does that work to begin with? See you later uh, during the lecture. <laughs>